this video is related to exercise 2a now the addition is 7th addition and book is d1 from exercise 2a question number 5 uh, and uh, onwards till the end will be solved in this exercise we have solved up to question number 4 in our previous lesson if you haven't subscribed the channel subscribe it to get the solutions of all the d's with the passage of time question number 5 says by using a number line arrange each of the following in ascending order now our numbers are 230 minus 13 23 minus 3 and 30 so this is the number line and the numbers are arranged over here minus 13 is the smallest number so minus 13 will be over here then minus 3 just before the 0 then 23 just before 25 then 30 and 230 at the end now they are in ascending order next part b is to arrange the numbers on a number line in ascending order these are the given numbers minus 10 is the smallest one so minus 10 is located over here then we have got minus 0.5 and minus 3 over 20 so here we have got minus 0.5 just before 0 and this this line which is a very thin one now it is minus 3 over 20 just before 0 then we have got 15 over here and then we have got 150 over here so this is the solution for part b now related to intermediate questions customer 6 part a absolute 0 defined as 0 kelvin is the theoretical lowest possible temperature this corresponds to a temperature of 273.15 degrees centigrade below 0 represent this temperature using a negative number now this is below 0 and how much below 0 it is 273.15 degrees centigrade below so for that we use a negative number that is minus 273.15 degrees centigrade part b is the lowest point in north america is the bad water basin which is 86 meter below the sea level 86 meter below represent this altitude using a negative number now below 86 meter is minus 86 meter next one is question number seven in which we have to insert inequality symbols now minus four is greater than minus six in this inequality sign mouth is open towards minus four and as we know minus 4 is uh, is greater than minus 6 being negative both numbers are negative so minus 4 is a greater one as compared to minus 6 b says minus 11 is again greater than minus 11.5 mouth is open towards minus 11 so minus in negative numbers the smaller the number the larger it is as compared to the other number which is 11.5 but being negative this minus 11.5 is lesser and this minus 11 is large or more 1 over 5 is less than 1 over 3 the mouth is open towards 1 over 3 which means 1 over 3 is greater than 1 over 3 is greater than 1 over 5 then we have got minus 1 over 3 is greater than minus 5 by 6 so this is the solution for question number 7 from question number 8 we have to use a number line to illustrate each of the following minus 1 over 3 2.5 1 whole 3 over 8 1 minus 0 0.2 and minus 0 0.11 so this is the number line and the arrows indicate the required numbers this is minus 1 by 3 then you have got minus 0.2 over here 
then we have got 0 0.11 over here then we have got 1 then 1.375 and then 2.5 now in this number line we have used 0.5 intervals 0 0.0 0 0.5 1 1.5 2 2.5 on both sides in the next question we have to indicate positive odd integers less than 20 now the positive odd integers less than 20 are the 2 is not included in the odd one so excuse over here this will not be the part of the answer 3 then we have got 5 then 7 then 11 then 13 then 17 then 19 okay this is the solution for this part so let me correct make a correction over here now this one will be coming over here now this is the solution of part c in this one prime numbers uh, here the diagram is correct the parts are basically interchanged so part b will be coming over here so let me adjust it like this okay now we have got it right now, in, now here prime numbers more than 20 sorry more than or equal to 2 prime numbers more than or equal to 2 and less than 20 this is 20 so prime number more than or equal to 2 2 is a prime number then 3 more than 2 then 5 then 7 11 13 17 19 and less than 20 we have to be restrict we have to restrict our answer till here less than 20 and in the next part we have to represent positive odd integers less than 20 that is one odd number positive integer 3 5 7 9 11 13 15 17 19 positive odd integers less than 20 then we have to represent common factors of 12 and 16 so these are the common factors of 12 and 16 1 is a common factor of 12 and 16 then we have got 2 a common factor of 12 and 16 then we have got 4 a common factor of 12 and 16 so apart now we have to pay focus on these two parts which were a bit interchanged i have made the necessary correction over here so this was complete solution of exercise 2a in my next video i will be uploading solution for exercise 2b d17 edition thank you so much